What's up guys, Mitchell Pelkey back with another video, another reaction video, stepping away from across, moving into something you guys absolutely love, the TikTok formal with Emily Cole, again with the roommate, James Hogan V behind the camera, the sexiest guy in America. We're gonna dive into it. I have actually never watched this after we filmed in New York City and Hoagie, have you seen it? Five minutes. Hoagie's attention span's brutal, so we're gonna get it going. What's up everybody? Episode of Chicks University. All right, before we start, I was You're so nervous and I was sweating. Luckily, I had a white shirt on because my pits were sweating so Wait, much. Can we get the rundown on how this happened? Just yeah, so so long story short. So obviously, Emily and I go to the Duke Forum. Everything goes well. We keep talking after that. And I know in the back of my mind that she's going up to the city to visit her sister and to celebrate her 21st. So as we're like talking in the in-between stage, I'm like, hey, like maybe I can come up, this and that, like trying to like, you know, work my yeah, way yeah, up yeah. there. You're trying to get in there. She's, she's trying hard to get She ends up like inviting me. I go up there, but when I first see her, I post a picture. Emily on my story with like the location of like the New York City or I think we were in Times Square or something and this girl Kat actually DM'd us off the Chicks You account was like hey like come by Barstool I'd love to get you guys on a podcast and little did I know she actually is dating a guy on the Ohio State hockey team no. Jake have you heard about that couple that met on TikTok <laughs> And See, MCO looks, looks like together. really like chill yeah. here. I feel like you're just and like just, freaking out. Well, I'm fired up. Uh, first of all, how about that black on black suit? That thing is drippy. So I'm Emily Cole. I'm from Houston, Texas, and I'm currently. Did you guys discuss before this like how you're gonna handle when they asked you like if you guys are dating or if you Dude, that's date actually out? that's something we we've never talked about. Because that was had to have been the tension like the whole time. And, and it was coming. weird you too. Was coming. Obviously, like that was the biggest question, but we like never talked about it before this podcast. Like this podcast, everything in this podcast is true, but like we never I talked about like dating too. Literally we're winging everything. My name is Mitchell Pelkey. I play lacrosse at Ohio State from Virginia. I create content on YouTube, TikTok. Now we're here in New York City. Everything started from just a TikTok. Let's go back to the original TikTok actually. I don't even told you guys this yet. The initial TikTok that I made about Emily, I came when it was Mitchell Pelkey, mustache not permanent. Like, I posted that and Hoagie actually texted me and she, he was like, yo, did you make a collab with that? Emily Cole Duke girl. I'm like, what do you mean? He's like, I just saw the TikTok and he goes, dude, she's hot. I'm like, dude, that's awesome. Funny story. Thank you, um, Mr. Jacob Wise. He's the reason we're all here today. <laughs> this morning, he's like, Kat, that Mitchell kid and Emily are in New York. I'm like, what? <laughs> and then he said it so casually. I was like, Jake, this is a big deal. Yo. Yo. Bring him on in. We got the Grinch is back in full effect. Met John Gruden. If you see Garrett Nielsen in the streets, slap him in the back of the neck. Don't say hi. location. I mean, the inside is pretty brutal. Mm -hmm. But uh, I'm I wouldn't sure. live in here. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even see that. I think I downloaded it at the beginning. I remember of... the first TikTok started was when you did the kitty cat killer. And T. Crayon was like, where's kitty cat? Well, the first one to go viral. It was a me doing this like kitty cat killer dance <laughs> so embarrassing i posted instagram as well the next day at practice our assistant coach coach crane is like doing the dance he's calling you kitty cat he's calling me kitty cat i started my freshman year of high school um i gave my buddy like a terrible haircut it went kind of viral like in my town he wakes up at five he's like Clipping oh, videos, yeah, like making his yeah. Yeah. Oh, don't, don't try to act like AMCO. AMCO saw that was like, he wakes up at five. It's <laughs> <laughs> a hard working man right there. So How did that time. conversation go with Emily with the white noise? What's probably the most interesting thing you've learned about Mitchell Pelkey? You have to sleep with white noise. <laughs> Are yeah. yeah, I'll never forget this too. We go out to dinner. She's like taking me a tour around school and it's like 11 o'clock. The libraries are packed. You're not seeing that at Ohio State on a Saturday night. Who do you think it runs fast? I don't know, faster or further? It depends. Oh, like this is a good YouTube video. You guys, look at this. That's a good idea. I you think it would be me? 100%. 100 yard sprint, who's winning? Emily Cole or Mitchell Pelkey? Mitch Pelkey. If anybody out there think Garrett Nielsen's cute, please DM me or DM Garrett. He really, He's he, he needs a girlfriend. Dude. Get us into the story. How did it start? What was going on in your life? When I first made that initial video, like literally in my head, I'm like, this is like, just another video like this isn't gonna turn into anything if you somehow did this that would be like crazy bro yeah. she actually responded <laughs> everyone was like oh my god after that like it was hilarious guys started like giving mitch a lot of crap in the yeah. locker room like typical lax typical, guys like print out a picture of emily cole and like put on his ruckus yeah. like i went to leave for sasso and there's a picture Absolutely. that somebody printed out of the duke track girl emily cole on my ruckus so and we'll it said it like up. put this in your TikTok. look right. with a the picture they put it on your ruckus yeah oh. <laughs> how weird is that that's actually <laughs> there was there was one person who like made a video but i can't remember he wasn't as cute yeah you doubt it. Hey. Hey. The Italians. Wow. I saw your response video and it was so funny. The I, hey. I will say that Mitch was pretty, you were pretty like clever with it. You were clever with it? At the same time, what's he doing down there? Let's call him. 
Let's pick it up. What? What are, you, what are you doing? We're filming a video up here. You're, you're messing around with your golf club? Happy Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> My friend's like, you should take him. He's really cute. And I was like, I don't know. Like, I don't you're know if I'm just, like, there, joking eh? or if like, I actually respond like what he's going to say. Like, if he would actually come. Crazy I'll thing is that it, it should have never worked out. Crazy Literally, the like, days lined like, up so that, perfectly. Never... Formal again was on a Sunday night. Uh, we had optional lift Monday. People were going home for a winter break. This was any other well, time of the year. It you wouldn't have no shot. Worked. All caps for my friends. It was um, Leah. She's like, Emco. He's cute. <laughs> just, oh, don't and pump then his... another one of my friend Sydney, she I'll was like, his tires. You don't take... what was happening on your end? Like, I think guys are just busting on you. Asking someone to form a like over video, over TikTok. Did you also that like, you've never met on his YouTube videos? I oh yeah. Did she sure. really so, think that you were gonna say no? Like, come on. Obviously, if I he never responded heard... to it, he would go. Like, he's not just gonna respond and be like, nah. With the first overall pick. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah. Yeah. That was all the time. <laughs> all timeline. All timeline. That was funny. Hey, Joe, will you come to formal with me? With the first overall pick in the 2021 college formal draft, Emily Cole selects your boys. All my boys were like iconic, me. iconic. Um, they were sending like our lax group chat and everything, so I was fired up. And then I shoot her a DM. And I was like, "You fire a DM or what? Yeah. What'd you say?" He said I was cute. Okay, because I was confused. I was like, "Did you yeah. have one Saturday and Sunday, and like you only got the cut the call for Sunday, and that's it?" <laughs> yeah, I had, I had so much. Is she like another guy the first night? The next day, I think we Facetime to talk about it. Yeah, and we were talking for like 20 minutes. How nervous were you for that FaceTime? Oh my god. I was so nervous. I remember I was facing a window, so the lighting would look so good on my skin when she like picked up. Did you oh get a pep god. talk from Tanker or what? I was in my room, I locked my door, I was like, Ma, don't come upstairs, like I'm FaceTiming her. <sighs> Oh my god, is that Mitchell? And she like came over, it was so funny, it was Naima. Oh, I, if I was her, I would have came right in the room and just hid and listened to the whole thing. <laughs> Got in the oh, that's a typical girl thing. Like that. they're lurking in the back, yeah, you don't know like, what you can yeah, say, Exactly, huh? yeah. Because you don't know who's listening. Yeah. yeah. And I look in my back seat where I hang out my suits, I, I forgot the I whole can't. entire suit. Oh, Five hours in, I forget god. the whole entire suit. I forgot the suit. That's like a huge thing that. on the Everyone team now. Everyone says that and I was like, I, I forgot, forgot the suit. suit. Everyone asked me, is the whole suit thing fake? It's not fake. I swear my entire life. Me and Garrett had class. So he's going to drive us to class on the way. He had like his helmet and gloves. He's like, can you like bring this down? Like we were rushing out and then like he dropped us off. I was so worried about bringing my camera and all that stuff to capture it that I like forgot about the actual like important part of the suit. And I forgot the suit. Three hours later and I just get a call from Mitch. Oh my God. You forgot the whole suit. Dude, I like that suit. <laughs> Luckily, the formal was on a Sunday. One job. Yeah, he just show up in a suit. suit. <laughs> My dad was like, Mitch, it's like you going to play golf and forgetting your clubs. Like, <laughs> <laughs> we were supposed to hang out Friday. Let me just... <gasps> yeah. There you go, sir. <laughs> I have to give you a hard time for it. Um, I, I said queen. was like, I don't know, seven. Okay, so you said you were going to hang out. And then we were going to hang out after. <laughs> I get around there like Friday at like 7 and I wanted to see my boy G who was here last year and now is at Duke. So I get there, getting to dinner on 8 or 9. We have dinner, it's already like 10 o'clock. I didn't want to like late night text her and she goes to bed at like 10. So I think it was like 10 30 when I text her like, hey, just left dinner, like, are you still up? And then obviously she didn't respond to the morning. It was my fault though because I said let's hang out after dinner, but like I didn't hit her with a text till like 10 30. Mm -hmm. A YouTube video and make some TikToks with another girl and then I come back around 3. Yeah, he had all the. I had said this. I knew I was gonna. I knew I was gonna get eyeballs as soon as I said that. I knew I had to plan out some other videos. You know, I'm taking advantage of the opportunity. I'm down there in North Carolina. Obviously, having two big universities, I had connections and I want to make content happen. Saturday comes around and we go get dinner. And I pick her up. I'm like so nervous. I'm, my mouth is watering. I thought I was gonna throw up. Honestly, I haven't told. Oh my god. We got some ice cream. Yeah. It's fire. And then we went to her place and watched the movie. And then Sunday came around the formal. Um, you okay. went to watch the movie. I'll tell you which movie too. It's well, called they, the, hey, the other no, movie. No, 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 because everyone was saying what movie in the group chat and you wouldn't say what movie, so you didn't watch anything. I did. You don't watch. know what you watched. I watched The Ugly oh, Truth. He doesn't know I watched The Ugly Truth. It's a great rom com doc. Uh, what happened? The guy. Uh, this yeah. guy. <laughs> Just watch the video. Shut the up. The Truth. It was actually a really good movie. I can tell you all about it. Could you? Yeah. 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 Good Fun movie. Fact, I'm a huge rom com guy. What does that say about me? It says you don't watch a lot of the movies. <laughs> we go back to one of the trap houses, have some fun, and then we go to this other place, have some more fun. And that was kind of the night. 
Yeah. It ended. It ended. Yeah. It ended. Just and, like uh, R.I.P. Yeah. yeah. So. Uh, oh, you guys got a good night's sleep. Yeah. Yep. So a lot of Z's. Obviously, it's doing that. You log your eight hours. And then. <laughs> you log your eight hours. Oh yeah, yeah. We went and got IHOP before, got which was really fun. Yeah. Um, I remember that TikTok y'all made with the IHOP with the. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, that, that, that was, that was uh, a good yeah. one. I knew she was going to New York. Every time we Facetime, I'm like, oh, like when are you going to New York? Yeah. I kind of swear like, they're my way. But Mitch also, though, like, loves New York. Like, New York's I been love your New spot, York City. bro. I love New York TikToks, Times Square. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah that was like, really You guys are on your full tour. Yeah. With Chicks U. Mm -hmm. So. So. Now you were like, oh. Yeah, I was the blood out. pressure. You were probably like. So. So. Are you guys dating? <laughs> And before, like, I swear to God, we've never talked about it beforehand. It's like, this is literally like our Are you gonna answer stone cold reactions. Gonna... He actually had we haven't talked about it, actually. Okay. Yeah. It's funny because that's like all anyone is asking. That is all anyone asking. Yeah. I got home for Thanksgiving break. I got like every mom in my town. Hey, you know Mitchell? What's him and the girl up to? I'm like, oh my God. We don't know. He won't tell us anything, so. We could ask another question. How was the first kiss? It was good. It was good. At least Mitch admitted to that. This guy wouldn't even, we didn't even know. Hey, pal. We wouldn't Hype even, me up. we didn't even know about that till this thing came out. He wouldn't even tell us. Unbelievable. We literally had a group of guys movie theater style, like clapping it up for him. We watched them walk in the locker room. Yeah, everyone, when Mitch walks in, everyone's like, hey. You guys, we got it out of that. We got it, finally. <laughs> I was like, you know, you're going to be going like, with this girl up to a different state that you don't really know, like make sure she feels comfortable. Aww. So shout out mom, mom Dukes. <laughs> shout out Miss Pearl for that. Hey, that's that that me. That's me. That 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 so my last piece of advice is just that you know dating athletes at Ohio State is great. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. She helped. She's helping. She's pumping your tire, helping you out there. Hey. Okay, we're all going to Ohio State in two weekends. Catch us there. And that's it. And still to this day, there is no label on us. Ellie and I still talk. Literally. Every single day, we FaceTime like every single night and text throughout the day. I think the future will tell. Yeah, <laughs> I have nothing to say. Again, comment videos down below that you guys want us to react to. Follow James on Instagram at James underscore Hogan V. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Deuces!